Hello heroes and villains, welcome to Multiverse. Today we are going to take a look at the Enhanced Heatwave style. Although the actual name in the style tab is Enhanced Pyromaniac. There's also a regular version of the style, but I only have uh, the headpiece I think so far. But I will show you the vendor where you can purchase the regular style. It is a pretty good looking style. Uh, although as you can see it is one of those styles that does not support an emblem. I guess they don't all have to support an emblem, but uh, we do have a whole bunch of, uh, of emblems. We do have pretty much an embarrassment of riches when it comes to emblem at this point. So it's always a bit, uh, a bit sad when we get a style that does not support an emblem. We have a lot of nice emblem we want to use, and uh, when we have a style where we cannot use the emblem, uh, it's always a bit sad. I gave a single color to each piece of the style so that you could clearly see which part is the shoulder, which part is the belt, and so on. And uh, let us remove uh, the shoulders, the belt, and the boots, and see if there's uh, maybe some uh, some surprise hidden underneath. So here we can see that the chest piece doesn't cover the hands, and uh, there is some sort of uh, built-in boots into the pants. So if somehow you don't like uh, the heatwave boots, uh, you can just decide not to wear them, and there's some actual boots underneath. Uh, nothing special about the back piece or the shoulders. And I can already hear you ask, where or where can we get the style? Let's take a look. So basically you can get it as random drop playing the World of Flashpoint missions. When you get your rewards at the end of the missions, uh, there is a chance that you will get a piece of the style. But the best option to be able to get a style is to just buy it from the broker. Uh, so here you can see the belt is fairly inexpensive. It goes all the way down to 40,000. For the boots, the boots shouldn't be that expensive either. Uh, the boots are 200,000. I guess they're a bit more expensive. The cowl is the one expensive piece. I had to buy it for like uh, 15 million. But here you can see it already went back up to 23 million. Uh, the fuel tank starts at 28 million, but it should go down a bit. So it goes down to less than 3 million. For the gloves, the gloves should be fairly cheap uh, as well. You can see here 50,000. So you can get the gloves for 50,000. For the legs, uh, uh, the legs... For the legs, it goes down to 600,000. The shirt might be a bit expensive. I got the shirt at the headpiece as random drop, so it was a, a bit fortunate, I guess. But here you can see the price goes down to 30 million. So that would be the most expensive bit uh, so far. And for the shorters, it goes down to 5 million, but I was able to get it for 3 million. So if you wait a bit, uh, you should be able to get it a bit cheaper. And I have to give my usual broker warning. These are the prices on the broker right now. Tomorrow, next week, next month, heck, later tonight, the prices will be different. So right now some of the style is still somewhat expensive because it's a brand new DLC. But as time goes by, the price should go down a bit more. For the regular version of the style, uh, you can get it as random drops playing the Flashpoint missions, or you can come and see our friend uh, Cobblepot's fans right here. So here the style is called the Thermal style, but it is the Pyromaniac style, and uh, this is the regular version of the style. So if somehow you don't manage to get the Enhanced version for whatever reason, you can come here and you can purchase the regular version of the style. We could already recreate a pretty good version of Heatwave in DC Universe Online, but now we do have an official Heatwave set of gear. Technically two if you count the regular version. And we have a whole bunch of uh, base items to recreate the Heatwave theme character. The Heatwave statue is uh, pretty awesome. So if you ever wanted to create an Heatwave theme character, the time is now. If you have any questions, feel free to ask so in the comment section down below and I'll see what I can do about answering your questions. I have roughly 2,000 videos about this universe online at this point, so if I don't answer your question right away, just search in my videos. Odds are, I already made a video that answered your question. Or click one of the videos that you see on your screen right now. Bye-bye.